I was choosing the repertoire for my debut album, I immediately realized it should be Brahms' first sonata, which became later center of my program. Brahms was only 20 when he composed this piece, however his Opus 1 is already a mature work. And I see in this music a breath of youth, passion, joy. It's full of brave virtuosity. On the other hand, there are some very deep and lyrical moments. I think they reflect Brahms' feelings as a young man. Another young man who presented in my program is uh, Sergei Prokofiev. He was only 22 when he composed his Opus 12. Prokofiev was known uh, as a rebel who, who opposed conservative and traditional ideas of teaching, composing, and he was very inspired by a cultural environment, uh, the avant-garde movements of futurism and suprematism, and one can notice it in his music. It's a combination of striking melodies, brutal rhythms, and extremely colorful harmonies that, that we are between naivety, irony, and pathos. Schubert's songs are kind of a breach between uh, works of young Brahms and Prokofiev. The selection of six songs establishes a mini, mini cycle within a program. There is a wide range of different feelings and, and moods, from joyful Morgenstern and uh, full of warmth and uh, love, sei mir gegrüßt, to very dark, desperate doppelganger and Aufenthalt. Die Taubenpost is one of the last songs of Schubert. It's surprisingly light and clear music, but it contains a lot of meaning, which is somehow hidden there. Recording a CD was uh, my dream for a long time, and I was very curious about the, the process. It was very exciting to be in search of better sound and color, and my goal was to express the characters of the pieces, their atmosphere and uh, my own ideas and feelings. Mm -hmm. 